That is that is so much wonderful dialogue that I just. Mm -mm. I keep apologizing for it too because I I do want to read that, but. Mm. And I have to read that loud. Everything. Okay, so let's go to the uh, vendor. Where are you? Over there. Sell the lost stuff. So we have some room in our bags. And then go do Mary's quest. Oh, I'm keeping that. Keeping that too for now. This should all be good then. No rich stuff. Well, that's 10,000 gold. I mean, worth it. Yeah, it's the best it's the best choice I can make for things I don't have to read. Oh, you're you're really really back? Okay. Well, time to prove yourself, I guess. I like this party. I'm very happy with this. Adventures can wait. Give you your stuff, Tristian. Level you up. Okay, you have this. It's a robe of fire, but this will look awesome on you. Okay, good. Okay, let's go. I need to catch my breath. Calm down. We'll get there, don't you worry. Six spares. Okay. Yes. Uh, let's see if we can... Why can't we go through... This is, this is so weird. I don't know what. I'm gonna go over here. Let's do that. New. No. What? What is this? A little islet. Isle? Islet? In the middle of Skunk River, topped by the two living rooms of a couple of blah blah blah, blah local fishermen. Okay. Uh, not now, but thanks. Discovering all the things. New. Oh, well, okay. Beep, beep. Um. <laughs> Adventure. May we have a moment wait. of respite? Christian? <laughs> I missed him though. I, I really did. I missed him. Be easy. 
easier if you not fight back. Oh. Whoopsie doodles. Let me go over there. No! Uh, how about you guys go do that? Anyone over here? No. Oh, the cat is helping. Yes. Come here, Bax. Not the cat of you. Oh. Now what do you do? That one. Yeah. Go, oh, Amiri. Which knife? Sport? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Good luck with that one. <sighs> okay, we're all super tired. I can see that. I know, right? Tamiri is amazing. Sport. Sport. And we're done. Uh, we could set up camp here right away. Get my um, affairs in order. Come on, Aaron. There we go. Okay. It's a pity you cannot hear Grotus's whisper. I would so like you to understand what I'm talking about. I'm good, thank you. But I do understand you. I do. But if I was busy listening to some whisper telling me about death, then who would cheer you up? Wonderful. Okay. Let's continue. We have stuff to do. Uh, knock knock? If you could, you know... Stuck. So, Chet, how far into the story are we now? Any ideas? I mean, after after Tristian did all, he, all his his things. <clears throat> Oh, hi. Okay, that's good to know. I have so much to do still. <laughs> I like it though. Who will prevail? Does it matter? You should have run. <laughs> has been amazing so far. I mean, the whole story... Whew. Oh, well then. The characters... And I, I'm not, I don't even have all the characters. 
Oh, hi. Um. Here. Consider me provoked. Notice awaits us. It's two. Okay. I was expecting three. Which is fine. Uh, two. To the dust. Strike. <laughs> Stop it! Good lord! Yeah, you're good? Okay then. <laughs> Here's a wild one. Yeah, I do miss a lot of character stories, that is true. But I am having my own playthrough besides this one. Uh, I'm trying to do an evil playthrough. Um, and I'm gonna do that way differently. Um, so yeah, I, I'll, I'll eventually learn about those stories as well. Let me see, how am I gonna get there this way? Ah! Well, apparently we found it! It's right there! Yes, we can go there too. See? Lindsay? Just do what I do. Just pack our stuff and go look for it. And ta-da! There it is. Ta-da! See, it's not that difficult. I don't see the problem. <laughs> it works for me. Oh. As you approach the Six Bears campsite, you hear some rising noise and rumbling. Gathered outside their tents, the men of the tribe are having a heated discussion over something. One of them, a huge grey-haired man with a scar on his face, shouts, Brothers! This cannot go on! We need a new chieftain, chieftain! Or this tribe is no more! After the Kinslayer killed Aikaya, we all acted like blind pups! We jumped into the trap, almost killed ourselves against the Bravoy. No real chief would let that happen. So what are you gonna be the new chieftain? Maybe you? Me? Oh no, the chieftain must know what threatens the tribe and be able to defend it. If we were home, I would fight for power. But here, in the southern lands, we did a different kind of chief. I say Nilek. What? There's grumbling in the crowd, but the barbarian continues shouting over it. Think! Who led us through Numeria? Was it Akaya? No, it was Nilek. Who negotiated with the local tribes while he huffed and beat his chest? Nilek! And who was the only one who saw the danger of Armag and his sisters? Nilek! Of course, a woman has never been leader of the Six Bears before. Just like Six Bears have never left our homeland before. If you want to survive, you must change! Nilek! 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 One by one, the barbarians stop arguing and join the chant. Soon the whole tribe is shouting Nilek's name. The girl steps from the crowd. Her face is confused, but glancing above the man's heads, she sees Amiri's encouraging smile and nods. One of the barbarians puts a necklace of fangs around her neck, once worn by Agaya. Brothers, I accept this. Oh, <clears throat> I, I have a very deep voice now. <clears throat> Let's do that over. Brothers, I accept this honor. I swear that I will lead and protect the tribe. Like every chieftain since the time of the bar bear ancestors. I will find a way to save us from the ghost that haunts us. And I will find a place for us in these strange southern lands. Get packed. We return to Numeria. <laughs> <laughs> I like this voice. The barbarians disperse and start to pack their tents. Nilek approaches and hugs Amiri. So this is how it all turns out. I still cannot believe it. I never wanted to be a leader, but you... You should be the chief. <laughs> there will never be no place in the sex... Six... Sex bear. Oh, wow.
only now she realizes that with just one letter changed, the whole thing changes. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, look over there. Oh. There will, be, there will be never no place in the six bears for me. But you can do it without me, sis. Oh, God. Oh, my body hurts from laughing. Oh, this is incredible. So, hi, Chet. How's your evening going? Ah. Congratulations, Nilek. <laughs> You're not on scene, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I need a second. <laughs> oh, yeah, our family friendly has been off since the beginning, and this is a really good thing. I'm letting myself go. This is the thing. <clears throat> Thanks. It seems that everything in the world will change someday. Yes. Um. So, where will you lead your tribe now? To Starfall. The evil spirit who haunts us is not that powerful. He doesn't dare attack near big settlements. Why don't you stay in my lands? Thank you. But there's no place for us here. These forests, swamps, rivers... Strange and unfamiliar people, the six bears want to be with our kin, the Kellids. Hey, Amiri, maybe you can return to your tribe? No. You heard what they said. Our pariah, kinslayer. Let us get them be changed. Even a chieftain's order will not make them forget what I did. Oh, good. Someone flipped that. <laughs> Thanks. Give them a thousand coins? Why? Farewell, Nilek. Have a safe journey. Bye bye. Nilek bows, Nilek bows to you. After Mary, farewell. I'll lead your tribe away. <laughs> yeah. Oh. I know, right? I mean, I like them, but to give them a thousand gold? I mean, is it really, really necessary? They seem to be fine. Um, <clears throat> now, I do wonder, what if I go to Armex tomb, like, right now? Like, right now? Now? Is that bad? Is that good? What will happen? I don't know. Let's find out, shall we? <sighs> Save it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It was right there. Oh, uh, yes. Might have rested, but hey. You know what I need? I need some grape juice. Ah, uh, just a little bit. There we go. Uh, Oh boy. Oh. <clears throat> Some grim barbarians are sitting near the bonfire, speaking in low voices and casting uh, sidelong glances toward the tomb entrance. Noticing you, one of them reaches for his weapon out of habit, but he catches himself and instead pats the space on the lock beside him. Greetings, travelers. Come, have a seat. Don't suppose you've heard anything about the battle between the Tiger Lords and Restov, have you? Who won? How did it go? Um. Wow, we beat back the barbarians. Let me show you how. <laughs> uh. And it wasn't even really a battle. The armies just stood staring at each other for a while, and then the barbarians turned to... Oh, well, no. 
Rumor has it the barbarian chieftain left his men. Oh, this one. Rumor has it the barbarian chieftain left his men in the middle of a battle, so they turned their backs on him and returned to Numeria. Really? Then what are we sitting around here for? Quiet. Numeria's far away and he's still very close. Oh. Uh, I'm going into the tomb. There's a sister standing guard at the entrance. She's a mighty witch, and she's crazy as a bat. She won't let you in. And even if she did, there are a lot of traps down there. And if you make it past the traps, ah, there's still Armac to deal with. He'll kill you. But hey, you're welcome to try. Oh, thanks. You know what? Aren't you fed up with the sister? I finished her off long ago. It's kind of scary. She's a witch after all. Look at him. Downright scared. No, you're right. It's long past time to rid ourselves of these witches and our crazy chieftain, too. Hey, everyone. Get the sister. Down with our mag. Oh, well, that escalated quickly. Oh, this is going to be fun. Oh, you. <laughs> I didn't even get to speak with her. <laughs> bye bye. See ya. Nope. I don't like you anymore. You keep lying. Wee! <laughs> and she's dead. So that's it. The witch is gone. There's no turning back now. Armac won't waste any time investigating. He'll just tear. He'll just tear our heads off. To the abyss with him. Are we supposed to wait here for him until we're old and grey? He's a traitor, not a chieftain. First he takes us to conquer Restov without any proper scouting, like sheep to the slaughter. And then he leaves his forces right before a huge battle to go digging around in some hole in the ground. Other chieftains have been deposed for far less. Right, enough is enough. I say whether he's alive or dead, we go back to Numeria. We'll tell the others everything, and they can choose a new chieftain. And good luck to you. Good luck to you too. And they leave. Bing bong, the witch is dead. La 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 Thank you, but don't mind if I do. That was easy. Loots. Uh, it's not that big of a map. Okay, cool. Okay then. I should rename my saves, actually. <clears throat> well, I guess it's okay to go in. I mean... We found it, so... I'm there. Hi. Oh, God. Spectres again. Wonderful. We come as dust. You might want to hold. I don't know if there's any traps. I'll let them come to you. Yep. Repent. They go down! <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>
We have done so many dungeons Indeed. in the past days. We felt a cold breeze as soon as we entered the room. Ice shards appear appeared on the walls and floors, and a labyrinth of thick ice walls grew up around us. The walls were waist high to a human, but they were head high to me. The center of the room had a pressure plate on the floor, while the entrance to the labyrinth had a massive pedestal carrying a tiger statue, statue made of ice. The exit was at, far at, at the far end of the room, locked of course, and the inscription above it, if, and the inscription above it read "Trial of Strength." The air in the room was cool, and the temperature dropped with each passing moment. It seems like the magic was stealing all warmth from the room. Bit by bit, wasting no more time, we... Um... Hmm. Started breaking through the walls to make a straight path to the yeah, but cheating. <laughs> Tried to cheat by standing on the pressure plate ourselves. Having come to the pressure plate, pressure plate, someone changed, uh, changed to look up and noticed a huge spot of black soot on the ceiling above it. The labyrinth builders must have anticipated our plan and, arri and arranged something special for anyone trying to cheat their way through. Taking that into consideration, we decided to find another solution rather than take any chances. We started breaking through the walls to make a straight path to the center of the room. Before biting, before the biting frost could turn us into icicles, we began breaking the ice balls and pushing the statue through the gaps, moving even closer to the center. Finally, the last wall fell and we pushed the ice tiger into the, onto the pressure plate. The pressure plate trembled beneath the st statue's weight and then a roaring pillar of flame erupted all the way to the ceiling. The ice tiger evaporated in a heartbeat along with the entire labyrinth. The room warmed rapidly, even becoming a bit hot. The stone door opened and the path was clear. Well then. Stony nut, I had to try. <laughs> I had to try. Oh, what? Oh, I don't like surprises. What did you find? What is this? A centuries old layer of dust covers the floor of this passage. No one has walked here in many years. Oh, <laughs> that's why you're there. I was wondering why you were lying there on the floor. A trivial task. What did I loot? What was that? It's like a... Um, what is that? Oh, okay. I was wondering what that was. 